everyone. I have been getting a ton of requests to share more grocery store hauls with you, so I thought I'd go ahead and do one today. I just got back from Target and Aldi, so I'm gonna start over here and share with you what I picked up at Target. I purchased four of these drink holders. These are so cool. So up here is where you put your drink and then you stake it into the ground. And I thought these would be awesome for when Dave and I have parties. We usually end up outside by the fire, playing volleyball or cornhole. So I thought these would be great to stick in the ground and then our guests could put their drinks in there and it would just be so much easier because you don't have to hold it. You don't have to worry about putting it on the floor. These were $4 a piece. Like I said, I purchased four of them. I found them back in the summer section. Uh, they had red, white, and blue. I just figured white went with everything. So I picked up all the white ones that they had. I'm hoping to find some more, but I thought that was really great. And for $4, I think that's a pretty good deal. Then I got two packs of the Canada Dry Ginger Ale. I got a pack of the Up and Up brand paper towels, and I also got a pack of the Up and Up brand paper plates. We don't use paper plates that often, but they're nice to have, so I just bought a pack. Then I purchased these Skinny Cow Caramels. These are amazing. They are so good. They're like a, a diet chocolate, but they don't taste like diet chocolate at all. They are so good. I would prefer these over most candy bars, to be honest. So I picked these up because I have a horrible sweet tooth and they're nice to have. It's nice to have something a little sweet around the house. So I picked those up. Then I purchased a new loofah. When I went to Target last time with my friend Liz, we did a whole shopping vlog adventure video. If you guys wanna see it and you haven't, I will link it below. But I purchased a loofah then and I got it home. I used it once and it fell apart completely and I had to throw it out. So I picked up a new loofah. I'm hoping it doesn't do that. This one's a little bit different. So hopefully I'm good with that loofah. And then I picked up two of these lingerie bags. I really like to use these when I wash bathing suits and things like that. I have two already and I felt like I needed some more so I got two of those. Then I bought um, Hook, the DVD. I was just telling David the other night how much I love this movie. I used to watch it all the time when I was a kid. It was, it was the best movie. So they had this, um, I just kind of randomly found it. It wasn't even in the actual section. And I picked it up and it was five bucks. So I'm really looking forward to watching this. David's never seen it, so I can't wait for him to see it. Then I picked up some of these cosmetic rounds uh, to use with my pressed powder. I picked up this Uno Dare game. They have their big um, clearance sale going on right now for toys and games. So I picked this Uno Dare game up. It sounds like it'd be really interesting. We have a lot of game nights at our house and we usually just play Cards Against Humanity, but I thought it'd be fun to do something different. So this was 426. I'm excited to try it. If you guys have played this, let me know what you think about it. Then I picked up some more hair ties. I just decluttered my entire vanity in my bathroom and I only had like three hair ties. I don't know how that happens, but they always go missing. So I picked up a new pack of those. And then over here are things I needed for recipes. So I got a bottle of Italian dressing to make my crockpot Italian chicken. I do have a recipe video on that. I will link it below for you. I picked up some crushed tomatoes for chicken rigatoni, some cream of chicken for my ranch, crockpot cream of chicken um, recipe that I have a video on as well. I will link it below. Some rigatoni noodles and then some penne. I picked up a bag of Doritos because I had a little bit of a craving for something salty, so I got those. I got a loaf of bread. I got some Hershey chocolates because I wanted to make s'mores, and last time I got stuff for s'mores, we didn't make s'mores, and I ended up just eating all the chocolate, so, you know, sometimes that happens. So I got two things of those, and then I got some heavy whipping cream for chicken rigatoni. I got some pizza crust um, for taco roll-ups. Oh my gosh, you guys, they're so good. And then I got a small thing of sour cream, again, for tacos. Small thing of milk. These um, dinner rolls, these are the best dinner rolls ever. If you guys have not tried them, check them out. They are so good, easy to make, really quick. So, love those. I picked up a thing of sweet butter lettuce. I usually have uh, a big salad for lunch and I use this lettuce, it's amazing. Picked up some shredded, finely shredded Parmesan cheese. And then the last thing I got at Target was the, uh, some chicken breast. I'm not sure this brand, Golden Plump chicken breast. So I got that. Then I went to Aldi really quick because I needed some produce, but the produce at Target is never very good. So I went, went into Aldi just to see what they had. I've never been there before. I was super excited to go check it out and I was pleasantly surprised. I had to run in really quick because I had all this cold stuff in my car. So I didn't get to look around too much, but from what I could see, it looked pretty amazing. Sorry I'm out of breath. I'm trying to hurry. I don't want my cold stuff to go bad. Um, I got this 
thing of butter lettuce. I have a thing for butter lettuce in case you can't tell. So I got that. I picked up this Bolt House Farm strawberry banana juice. This was $2.99 and this is like a big size. Normally the single serving bottles at Publix are $2.99 so can't beat that. I got this thing of tomatoes. I love tomatoes. So yummy. I got one avocado. I have recently become a huge fan of avocado so I just got one for now. And then as I was walking out, I saw these freeze-dried items. So I got freeze-dried strawberries and freeze-dried apples. I thought this might be a good alternative when I have a craving for something sweet. This entire bag is only 120 calories. So I'm excited to try those out. Like I said, I was really surprised with Aldi. I don't know. I just wasn't expecting it to be that great, but it was pretty awesome. So that is everything I picked up at Target and Aldi. I hope that you guys enjoyed this haul. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, everyone. And today I have a CVS couponing haul to share with you.